Anti-Cancer Activity of Broccoli Broccoli is a cruciferous vegetable that has gained significant attention for its potential anti-cancer properties. Its anti-cancer activity is attributed to various bioactive compounds and mechanisms, although it's important to note that research in this area is ongoing and the exact mechanisms are not fully understood. Broccoli is not only a vegetable that is mostly consumed in masses, but also one that supplies so many nutrients. It's an excellent source of vitamin C, which is an antioxidant which helps protect cells from oxidative damage and supports the immune system. Broccoli provides vitamin A in the form of beta-carotene, which is important for maintaining healthy skin, vision, and immune function. It is rich in vitamin K, which plays a vital role in blood clotting and bone health. It assists in calcium absorption and bone mineralization. It contains folate that is essential for DNA synthesis and repair. Broccoli supplies the body with minerals such as potassium, calcium, iron, selenium, and magnesium. It is also a rich source of dietary fiber, which aids in digestion, helps maintain a healthy weight, and may reduce the risk of certain chronic diseases. Most importantly, broccoli contains various phytonutrients, including sulforaphane, indole-3-carbidol, and flavonoids, which have been associated with potential health benefits, including cancer prevention. Let us now look into how broccoli brings about its anti-cancer properties. They are achieved through broccoli's number one, antioxidant properties. Broccoli contains high levels of antioxidants, including vitamin C and E, beta carotene, and various phytonutrients. These antioxidants help neutralize harmful free radicals in the body, which can damage DNA and lead to cancerous changes in cells. Number two, anti-inflammatory agents. Chronic inflammation is linked to the development of many types of cancer. Broccoli contains anti-inflammatory compounds like camphromol and quercetin, which may help reduce inflammation and lower cancer risk. Now let's take a moment to study these antioxidants and anti-inflammatory agents in broccoli. Camphorol is a flavonoid present in broccoli that has antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties. It may help reduce inflammation and lower risk of chronic diseases. Quercetin is another flavonoid found in broccoli, known for its anti-inflammatory and antioxidant effects. It can help neutralize free radicals and reduce inflammatory responses in the body. As you already saw, broccoli is a good source of vitamin C, which is known for its antioxidant properties. It can help reduce oxidative stress and inflammation. While not as abundant as vitamin C, broccoli contains vitamin E, alpha tocopherol. It is another antioxidant that plays a role in protecting cells from oxidative stress. Broccoli is also rich in dietary fiber, which has been associated with lower levels of inflammation. Fiber can also support a healthy gut microbiome, which plays a role in regulating inflammation. As well, broccoli contains a small amount of omega-3 fatty acids, which have anti-inflammatory properties. These fatty acids may help reduce inflammation in the body. Broccoli contains various phytonutrients and antioxidants, such as beta-carotene, lutein, and zeaxanthine, which may contribute to its overall anti-inflammatory effects. Beta-carotene is a carotenoid that gives certain fruits and vegetables their orange or yellow color. It is a precursor to vitamin A and serves as an antioxidant in its own right. It is important for eye health and immune function. Lutein and zeaxanthine are primarily known for their role in eye health, particularly in protecting against age-related macular degeneration and cataracts. They also act as antioxidants, helping to reduce oxidative damage in the body. Broccoli contains glucosinolates, which are sulfur-containing compounds. When broccoli is chewed or digested, glucosinolates break down into bioactive compounds, isothiocyanates, including sulforaphane and indole-3-carbonyl, or I3C, both of which have been linked to anti-inflammatory effects. These two compounds play a special role in cancer prevention. Number three, sulforaphane. Sulforaphane is a sulfur-containing compound found in broccoli and other cruciferous vegetables. It has been extensively studied for its potential cancer-fighting properties. Sulforaphane is known to stimulate the body's natural detoxification enzymes, which can help eliminate potential carcinogens and reduce the risk of cancer development. Number four, indole-3-carbonyl. Broccoli contains indole-3-carbonyl, a compound that is converted into dijindolemethane, or DIM, in the body. DIM may have protective effects against hormone-related cancers like breast, prostate, and ovarian cancer by influencing hormone metabolism. There is more to broccoli than these active compounds, such as number five, ability to repair DNA. 
Some studies suggest that broccoli may enhance DNA repair mechanisms in cells, helping to maintain the integrity of genetic material and prevent the development of cancerous mutations. Number 6. Anti-angiogenic effects Sulforaphane in broccoli may inhibit the formation of blood vessels that supply tumors. This can limit the tumor's access to nutrients and oxygen, hindering its growth. Number 7. Providing support to the immune system Most compounds in broccoli may boost the immune system's ability to recognize and destroy cancer cells. So if you used to hate broccoli, now is the time to like it and add it to your meal. Eat more to become free from cancer.